Hi, beloved. How you doing? Hi, it's me, Tamari. How you doing, guys? I hope all is well. All right. I am here with another word. All right. Another message. All right. Yes. And today, daily mood topic is lone wolf, beloved. Yes, that's our topic for today. I know you must be wondering what a lone wolf. All right. Yes, <laughs> a lone wolf. Okay. All right, yes, so I'm going to read the Bible verse from Jeremiah 5, verse 6. And it says, Therefore, a lion from the forest will attack them. A wolf from the desert will ravage them. A leopard will lie in wait near their towns to tear to pieces anyone who venture out. For their rebellion is great and their backslides many, right? Yes, so what the scripture is saying to us in Jeremiah 5, verse 6, beloved, it is saying, beloved, that there are some people who, you know, keep on hearing the word of God, right? Yes, but they are like a lone wolf, right? Yes, and even though they're hearing the word of God, right? It's like they're deceiving them own self by not believing the word of God, none at all, right? Yes, you have some people out there like that. They are like a lone wolf, right? Yes, they deceive them own self. Even when they hear the word of God, even when the word of God is right before them, they're not, you know, acknowledging it. They're not believing the word of God, none at all. They're not believing the word of God, none at all, beloved, right? So they are like a lone wolf. They become like a lone wolf, right? Because the word of God, right, is coming to the forefront on a daily basis to them, right? Yes, even though they are hearing it, they're not understanding, they're not receiving it into their hearts, they're not receiving it into their spirit, beloved. So they're like a lone wolf. They become like a lone wolf. Have you ever seen a lone wolf, beloved, in the forest, right? What they do, right? They go tippy-tappy, tippy-tappy, round and about, right? Yes, not receiving, not getting, right? Yes, not over you know, standing, not understanding rather, right? The messages that they are receiving into their, you know, they're seeing it, they're hearing it, right? They're seeing it, but they're not registering it on their heart. They're not putting it on the tablet of their heart, right? They're not believing it, none at all. So it's not on their heart. When you don't believe something, it's not on your heart because when you believe something, it's on your heart, all right? Yes, just like love. When you love, you love from the heart, right? So it's there, right? So they're not receiving the word none at all because they're not believing it, beloved. Like, so they become like a lone wolf, right? So they keep on telling themselves, you know, that, you know, God will not destroy them, even though they're receiving the word, they're hearing the word, right? Yes, they're, they, you know, what when I say receive, like they're seeing it, right? But they're not, you know, believing it, right? Yes, they're not putting it on the tablet of their heart. Remember, guys, they're hearing the word, they're seeing the word, but they're not writing on the tablet of your heart. And that's where God wants us to put it. Not on our mind, you know, you know, for us to just hear it, for us to just see it, but put it on the tablet of our heart, right? So even though they're getting the word, the message every day, right? Yes, they're just not receiving it none at all on the tablet of their heart so it's like they're deceiving themselves right because they're hearing the word seeing the word but not believing the word not acknowledge god word right yes they're not receiving it to themselves on the tablet of their heart and they think to themselves that god will not destroy them but i'm here to let somebody to today know that you are getting the word of god on a daily basis because he's trying to you know, say something to you, right? He's trying to make you see his truth. He's trying to reveal himself to you, but you are not taking heed. So you become like a lone wolf, right? Yes, because you are not, you know, putting the word of God on the tablet of your heart. You're not receiving it into your heart, beloved. You're only seeing it. You're only hearing the word, but you're not receiving it, none at all, on the tablet of your heart. So you're, you're deceiving your own self and you keep on telling yourself that God will not destroy you. But I'm here to tell somebody to know that this is a wake-up call. This is a wake-up message for somebody out there, beloved. Stop just seeing the message with your eyes and hearing it, but you know, let it be on the tablet of your heart, beloved. Receive the word of God, right? Yes, don't deceive yourself and not, you know, 
have the word of God on the tablet of your heart, right? Yes. And don't think to yourself for one second that God will not destroy you, right? Yes. So receive this word with faith and confidence, beloved, with a knowing, right? That God, right, is saying something to you, beloved, right? Yes. Because there is so much God always gives, his, you know, his warning, his little warning, right before he brings forth his judgment i saw god moving you know, or god you know give his little you know tippy tappy you know what word right yes so we can acknowledge it right so we can recognize it right yes and have it on our heart and 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 take heed to his word right yes so don't think for a sp split second beloved son of god beloved that of god that god will not destroy you he will do it right yes because there is so much that he will do you know what I mean? Oh, he's warning, keep on warning, keep on warning, keep on sharing his message. And all you do, beloved, is just hear it, seeing it with your eyes, but not take heed to have it on the tablet of your heart. All right, beloved? Yes, so that's a lone wolf, guys. Right? Yes. I pray you have a wonderful day. I pray that you will receive this word from Jeremiah 5, verse 6. And I pray that you will go and read the scriptures of jeremiah 5 verse 6 for yourself meditate on that scripture apply it in your life beloved because god is saying something to somebody out there i don't know who you are that need this word that you keep on hearing the word of god you keep on seeing the word of god on a daily basis but you're not taking heed none at all right yes you keep on deceiving yourselves right yes you know you keep on not acknowledging the word of god beloved god wants us to acknowledge his word to believe in his word and have it on the tablet of our heart right yes i pray of a blessed day and a wonderful you know week in the mighty name of jesus blessed love beloved all right yes